Hello everybody, I'm Dai Kamaragai, and today is a bit of a different video. It's both an unboxing and, I guess, a comparison review. So, some time ago I did the Ultraman Decker DX unboxing, and then, when I was in Osaka at Universal with my buddy, I went to a store and I found this, a Memorial D-Flasher. Yes, they made a Memorial uh, Decker D-Flasher. I didn't know about this, and I thought about grabbing it just because... Why not? I figured a comparison video could be a little fun. And apparently these are becoming more common of Ultraman devices that they don't really plan to make Ultra replicas of, of them to get Memorial Editions. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to open it up and compare it with the DXD flasher and see what the main differences are. Eh, not sure if this is going to be um, what you could call a typical unboxing, but whether or not, let's get right into it. So it just comes with the D flasher and the cards themselves. Ooh, these cards do look a bit different. So we've got Decker Flash type, Strong type, Miracle, his final form, and uh, oh, cool! It comes with the little uh, the little AI buddy from the show. And this just looks like him in his miracle form, but his color timer is going off. Nope, okay, that's something else. Huh. I'm sure someone would let me know in the comments. Hmm. It looks a little bulkier than the standard one. I need to put some batteries in it. Okay, so for a quick side-by-side, -side, this is the Memorial, and this is the DX one. And they are pretty identical. All in all, this one's got more vibrant colors, like the colors are a bit darker, and it's a little bigger. Like, it's hard to tell, but it is a slightly larger. All right, I'm going to go ahead and put some batteries in that. Oh, the cards are very different. So these Memorial cards, in comparison to the DX cards... The DX cards have a bunch of these little writings and whatnot on the back. And these memorial ones are just the cards themselves. I actually really like that. Oh, right. Of course. Okay, it's not really sliding in all that well. There we go. Okay, so all in all, other than the cards, it's pretty... Okay, nope. It's pretty similar to the, uh, the DX. And the cards don't slide in very effortlessly, so there's pretty high chance of them getting damaged. Thank you for joining me for this ultra unboxing and slash comparison. And yeah, the Memorial is pretty nice. It's definitely a bit bulkier and it feels more sturdy. Though the card slot is a bit more rough because the cards um, don't slide in and out as smoothly as the DX. 
but all in all, I am happy to add this to my collection and I will be looking for more memorials in the future, though ultra replicas will still be my priority when it comes to Ultraman stuff. Anyways, that's all I got for now. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Remember, it's always Ultra Time.